guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are back on Trivium and the song is called In the Court of the Dragon. It's a song that has only just dropped and my good friend Christy has been straight on it and told me exactly how it was coming out, etc. And said, get on it, it's going to be big. Uh, and I believe her because she's like Trivium's number one fan. So thanks Christy for pointing me in this direction. Uh, I'm looking forward to it because as with everything in Trivium, it's a fucking banger all the time. They're always brilliant with the music, they're always good with the lyrics, even though I don't get the means all the time because I'm stupid. But I mean, that's that's what we have to do, reactions, aren't we? Anyway, before we jump in this reaction, if you do actually like my videos, then please consider hitting like and subscribe. It supports me, it supports the channel, and I appreciate it very, very much. So, let's see what meaning they get wrong this time. This is Trivium, in the Court of the Dragon, official video. Let's go. Somebody's crashed. Nothing to do with the song, probably. <laughs> oh, he's coming on like a film. Let him make foul film. Okay. Court of the Dragon, Death of Gods and World. In the Court of the Dragon, you will know your worth. Hasta as he greets those crossing from from Aldebaran to Carcosa. Not a clue. Let's go. <laughs> Somebody's quote. It was very cult like and gothic sort of thing. Very dramatic. What? Fucking drums! Oh, the fucking energy in this song is absolutely brilliant. It's like, 
with the fuck it, I mean, they're losing my headphones and everything. The drums are fucking awesome. The the scream is blatant. I'm not fucking clear what he's saying. I don't care because the music is full of energy. I am not sure uh, what's going on in the video. Some guy's getting black shit poured all over his head by these two dudes in red uh, capes and hoods, whatever. And it's switching between that and somebody having their laptop charger taken off him. Who fucking cares? It sounds awesome. Completely, completely, completely and utterly caught me off guard. I was sitting in, like, waiting for the film to start. It felt, it felt like I was sat watching a film. Then suddenly it's like, ah! She's like, what the fuck? Oh, my God. Um, if there's a meaning in this, if this video on the song, I am totally and totally, utterly missing it. And I don't mind because the music's fucking incredible. And Christy was right. It will be a banger. And I'm swearing a lot because it's a screaming song and I like screaming shit. So let's go. Sounds fucking cool the way that was coming. Then I'll start, I'll start getting the because I've got something to say about the video here. It looked like the, these three dudes, the, the three wise murderers, if you like. That's what they look like when they come walking over that sand dune. Was chasing this guy who's dressed very eccentrically. I, I don't even know what, like a Tudor outfit. And he was, one minute he's, he's going to get killed by these people. And he, he does some sort of prayer, does a reading. And they just drop the weapons and fell on the floor. I don't know why. I don't care why. Let's fucking go. This next bit sounds in fucking sane. Let's go. Yeah, let's go up in Ugh. It's very, it's very, very clever how they're all social distancing in this video because they're all you know, they're all properly spaced out away from each other to conform, uh, which is very, very good in this time, this this time and this sign of the times, etc. Because we have to social distance. Um, this video, this song is bonkers. It's goes, it goes from sixty miles an hour to a hundred miles an hour to a thousand miles an hour. It's head blowing stuff. This.
lot of people getting killed in this video. <laughs> I mean, the two old dudes, the uh, deers have been killed. These, the three wise murderers have been killed by. Is he saying that people are getting killed by religion? I don't know because this guy was doing the reading. I, I, I don't even know how to interpret this, but I, I noticed they put him in that sign that that that, that what was on the the beginning of the video and on, on our computer screen. And I hope them guys who've walked into the sea with their computers have got insurance because they're going to be fucked, aren't they? Let's go. <laughs> Wow. I reckon that's the end. So let me uh, see if there's any more. Any more films of that? Nope, there's no more films of that. So rather than you guys watch me watch credits, <laughs> um, it's probably going to come up with people's names or something, actually. Based on a story by Lachlan Mars and Ryan McFall. So it's a story that somebody else has made. What is the story? <laughs> What's the story of that song? I have no clue. I do not know what was going on in that video one iota. But what I will say is that song was an absolute banger and a great, great uh, find by Christy to tell me to do it now because it came out today, this song. So it's, it's very, very rare that I get on a song on the same day, but, you know, I've got a bit of time, so I've jumped on it now. Um, so... Let me see if there's a song fact for this uh, to see if we can shed some light because I am baffled. Nope, it is in. It is too uh, new to, for there to be a song uh, meaning in the song fact. So if anybody actually knows the meaning of this song, please let me know in the comments. Let me know what you thought of the song and the reaction. No thing, man. Wasn't really much of a reaction because I ain't got a fucking clue what people were talking about in this or singing about. But I tell you one thing, like I said, the music was absolutely banging and it went from so many different speeds and different. It was just awesome on the ears and my genre. Anyway, um, if you like the videos, then please hit like and subscribe and support me on Patreon or any of the social medias, then the link is in the description. Thanks for watching. I shall see you on the next one.